let's map our code with our design. So we map the class name, the class attribute, and the implementation of class method. This code shows partial implementation due to space constraint in this slide. The process is the same for other classes, attributes, and method to declare a class attributes and as well as the method. Here I have prepared the implementation of class contact. Due to space constraint, not all are implemented in this slide. I leave it the rest of the implementation to you. We have implemented two classes which are store.java and contact.java. Now we want to implement the association of one-to-one -one for class store and class contact. Open your store.java. To implement the one-to-one -one relationship between store and contact, we will make contact as member of store. Okay. So how do we do that? We type private contact and contact. The name of the object. This is the class name. This is the object name. Then implementation of one-to-one. -one. So contact will be a member of store so since this uh, this is private it will keep it will ask us to provide getter and setter then we just hover it click this and it will be added for us okay so this is how we implement one to one we put an object of contact as member in store this slide here show the mapping of one-to-one -one association implementation. An object from class contact has become a member in class store.